One of the things you see with people who are psychotic, drift off into the landscape of their imagination, is that they dwell on such states of possession. Mm -hmm. So, for example, these kids that shoot up high schools, like they're fantasizing under the influence of rage and resentment for thousands of hours. That just takes control of them. It's not a simple impulse. It's like they've inverted the, you could think they've inverted the neurological order and the god of rage is now the, what would you say, the leading personality of integration or the god of resentful rage, even worse. There are certain conditions, including depression, where the direction of flow between the prefrontal cortex and the insula literally reverses. It's like running against the typical traffic. You're uh, presenting in the context of rage or in, uh, sociopathy and, the, and these kids who uh, shoot up schools. But I do absolutely subscribe to what you just said, that if one drops into one of these more primitive states and emotions and all the things that go with it for a very long time, it's almost as if um, the governor, which is the prefrontal cortex, starts to become the governor.